An Alamogordo woman says she witnessed a horrendous puppy mill and animal hoarding situation in Doniana County, but is unable to get any help from authorities. We want to warn you, some of the video you're about to see is disturbing. ABC 7's Jamie Warren joins us live from, our, from Alamogordo via our New Mexico mobile newsroom. Jamie? Rick and Estella, I'm at Animal Village, New Mexico, here in Alamogordo. And as you can see, and maybe even here, I'm surrounded by English Bulldogs. The director, Sonny Aris, rescued over 40 of these dogs, took them in her care from a puppy mill just west of Las Cruces. Now, Aris tells me that the property owner notified her of the terrible conditions a tenant kept the dogs in. Photos she took of the backyard show dozens of dogs and puppies living among the carcasses of several dead decomposing goats. She says she asked the sheriff's office for help but didn't immediately receive it. Aris says she got permission from the property owner to start removing the dogs and put them in her care. And the sheriff's office says that basically they would want to help, but they didn't have permission to get onto the property. Dogs had attacked uh, the goats when they were abandoned. Maybe there was nothing to eat. They had slaughtered the goats. There were corpses everywhere. The smell was horrendous. The flies were horrendous. When we were there on Friday, we just didn't have permission to go and, and investigate any type of hoarding uh, scenario. Furthermore, if the number of animals were on the property, as the reporting party claims, um, she should have left them there. Um, by removing the dogs from the property, she has just removed evidence that we could have used in a criminal investigation. And the sheriff's office told me that they did receive a call from the property owner, but they were given a slightly different story. And I'll give you that angle coming up at ABC 7 at 6. Live from Alamogordo with our New Mexico Mobile Newsroom, Jamie Warren, ABC 7. Jamie, thank you very much for that report. Don't go anywhere. Our storm track weather first alert continu coverage continues right after the break. Stay with us.